Question 20. 25 students in class A did a science exam. 30 students in class B did the same science exam. The mean mark for the 25 students in class A is 67.8. The mean mark for all the 55 students is 72.0. Work out the mean mark for the students in class B. So we've got the mean for A. We've got the mean for B. It seems like it, it might be a tough question, but we've, when you're finding means, uh, it's all about finding totals. Okay, So if we worked out the mean for all the students, so, so all students, so total mark for all students. Okay, so we're going to have all the marks up. Okay, so the mean mark for all the 55 students is 72. That means, remember, that something divided by 55 gives 72. So if you do 55, because it's like, it's as if every student got 72. So if you take 55 and times it by 72, you're going to get the total number of marks for the students. So 55 times 72 is 3960. 3960. So that's the total marks for all the students. So now what we'll do is we'll find the total marks for um, the class A. So again, we've got 25 students in class A and they got a mean of 67.8. So it's as if every student got 67.8. So you're going to take 25 and you're going to times it by 67.8. So 25 times 67.8. And that gives us 16995. So now, because you know the marks for class A, and you know the marks for all of them added up, all you've got to do is find the difference, and that will give you total marks for class B. So it is 3960 subtract 169. Five three nine six zero oh, subtract one six nine five, which is two two six five. And then all you got to do to find the mean mark for class B is take so the mean is two two six five divided by how many are there? Thirty students in class B. So divide that by thirty, and you get one hundred and fifty one over two, which is seventy five point. Five. And that's it.